Hi. In this tutorial, we are going to see what SAS variables and how to customize Ionic application by overriding its predefined values. SAS variables normally act as a variables in which we can define and store a value to it. This stored value can be used in multiple places and the syntax for SAS variables starts with a dollar sign. The advantage of SAS variable is that we can change the value in one place and this will get changed all the instance where it is used. I have a ionic2 instance running. This is a fresh instance. Now I am going to define a variable as text padding with some random values and another one as font size as 25 pixel this is the sas variable and this is the value which it holds and I am going to create a text inside the paragraph tag this variable value can be used inside the sas file I am going to use it for the paragraph tag. For the padding, I am using the variable text padding. This is the way which SAS variable can be used. And the font size is I have defined the variable inside the variable dot sas files. This can be found under the source directory theme where you will find variable dot sas. I am going to save this one. It's building. Yeah, the style has been applied. You can check it by inspecting. The values get updated. We have about more than 1500 predefined SAS variables for Ionic is here. I am going to use some of the variables to customize my app header. I have used toolbar MD title font size as 20 pixel and the toolbar title color as green as well as the background as black. I am going to save this. For overriding these values, you can use the variable dot sas file. I am going to save this file. Yeah. The header has been changed. I have listed down all the predefined variables. In the comment section, you can use that to customize your Ionic application. Thanks. Hope this will be useful for you. Please subscribe.